Now, you're doing that, putting into practice a VCU. You're wearing a T-shirt. That Go ahead, flash it. Unafraid. 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 <laughs> Tell us what's happening at VC. What are you guys up to? I know so it's a lot of work. We have launched a new brand platform that is Uncommon VCU. And the whole premise behind that foundation is that VCU is a very unique place. It is not like any of its peer institutions across the state. And there are a variety of reasons and rationale behind that. And we are choosing to take a very bold, authentic stance with how we message what our areas of distinctive excellence are. And so that's the premise behind the campaign and, it, the, and the, simpli the, the simplicity of what it's grounded in is the notion that as you think about higher education and you think about the healthcare category, it's a sea of sameness. And so we spoke to as part of the process, over 2,000 people had conversations with key stakeholders, leadership, faculty, students, alumni, prospective students, prospective parents, patients, medical professionals. So we talked to a lot of folks to really synthesize what VCU stood for. And what we heard that came through very clear was that in that sea of sameness, the metaphor I use is that it was like a, it's like a barrel of apples. And you have a barrel of wonderful apples. You've got your Granny Smith's, your Red Delicious, you got your green apples, you got your red apples, some are sweet, some are sour, but at the end of the day, they're all apples. Mm -hmm. And since our formation, we've been talking about Virginia Commonwealth University in the context of being one of the apples in the barrel, when the reality is we're not apple at all, we're an orange. And we've never okay. taken the time to talk about our brand, our essence, our authenticity, to the traits of an orange and celebrating our orangeness in the midst of all the apples. We've always compared ourselves to the other apples, but we're not that. So let's take this opportunity, this point in time, to talk about ourselves in a very distinctively different way. But you've got, you've got deans, you've got program <laughs> leaders, you've got faculty. I know how difficult they can be. I was one of them. You've got a lot of voices that that need to feel heard in the process. Was that a challenge? The hearing of the voices, no, was not a problem at all. It was really taking all of that and, again, going back to my philosophy of simplifying the message and what is a platform that we could create that would enable us to elevate the brand but also allow all of the sub-brands, all of the school units and all of the divisions to live very comfortably and authentic within that space. So you can still speak about being uncommon VCU or unafraid or unapologetic or untraditional and then allow that to apply to the School of Medicine or Dentistry or Engineering or the School of the Arts or Business. So everybody has a home as part of this platform because it is talking about how distinctively unique and special we are, the expertise that we have our economic impact to the state, you know, awesome. our research, you know, 400 million. So we're able to tell all of those stories as part of this platform. And it is part of our DNA. It is authentically true. There, there's something really cool about what, what's, what's happening at VCU, which is that it, it, I think of it, whether you do or not, I don't know, but, mm -hmm. but do you think of it as a challenger brand, which is I want VCU to be thought of the same way we think of the best universities in Virginia, because it belongs in that pantheon of the best universities of Virginia, but it's fundamentally different. Mm -hmm. So the challenge as a marketer is how do you do that without looking and sounding just like those other, those other places? Right, right. right. But, by, but by fitting in over all of these years, we're not distinguishing by ourselves. You're not standing out. And so right. we have to act, we are, and we have to act like a challenger yeah. brand. Yeah. Because our aspiration is we believe that we are a strong enough academic institution that we should always be on the short list for anybody considering No question college. about it. Yeah. Always, the yeah. short list of three. There's a lesson here that I think is so interesting and important, which is that, that if as a marketer, when you start, if you start with something that is true about your brand, about your company, about your organization, and you can interpret that truth in a way that can kind of 
give it new energy, give it new visibility, but never depart from the authenticity of that truth, you can be onto something really, really important. Rather than saying, what is everybody else doing and how do I do something more like that so I can fit in with them? Or what does my target audience want and how do I take that in and try to give that back to them? Start with something that's true about who you are and then interpret that in a way you know will connect with your audience.